adding a part in our program basically is very simple. From the admin or from the sales area, you're going to go to the where it says add part, and we're going to click add part. Now, some of our distributors that we work with have Eclipse numbers, and if you add those Eclipse numbers here, it may pull in the price from your distributor. However, you can leave that blank. But let's add a part that we're going to buy from a distributor that we normally don't buy from, so maybe the price is going to be kind of high, and let's call it a motor. So that motor, and we're going to call it a uh, special uh, non, we'll call it special OEM motor. We're not going to give it a description, but we're going to say that that motor costs $350. Leave out the dollar signs and don't put decimals. Um, and then uh, we're going to select a unit of measure, which is each. If we wanted to not use the category that we're, we're going to provide, we would load a, an image here. Otherwise, select the category and find fan motor. So we're going to go indoor fan motor. And then if you're using this for service, then we would say one hour or maybe two hours is primary. And if it were a secondary part, you would put a, a, a substandard of two hours. But let's call it two hours. So no matter how we choose it, it's two hours. The significance of the category is it will pull in the image and the description from Lexicon for this motor and the description and the image here. So we click save, and now that particular part is saved to our database or your database. So now let's see how that's gonna to apply to one of our service tickets. Let's go create service ticket. And we're gonna title this Gibson Upstairs. Again, we're just gonna search an address. We're gonna choose a salesperson. We're going to say no AC found faulty fan motor replace fan motor. This is a special order OEM motor. I'm going to come down to parts and expand. And I'm, going to, I'm going to include this as a primary part, which will pull in the primary time. So I'm going to say special fan. Let's see if it comes up or however we actually let's go OEM. So there's our motor special OEM. I click add part and it brings it in and it will calculate the price based on the, uh, the what we have in the defaults for that particular uh, range of, of markup. Okay, so now that our ticket is saved, uh, you'll notice as we go to the bottom, we, we now have a place to put eternal, internal notes for this service call. And I'm going to go to the bottom and click Print Ticket. And it's going to pull up the service discovery. So now you notice what has happened here is we have, we have uh, used the description from Lexicon. Talks about, and it gives an image, you know, it, and this is just a general generic image and description. The customer doesn't really know what it's going to look like. But basically, we, we pulled in enough information from our database to be able to uh, substantiate the cost of $775. So that's how you add a part, use a category, and the category pulls in the description within our program. Again, you can call our office if you have issues, 904-260-2622.